Hello and welcome in, I am Matt from Get Quirked and this week's video is answering some questions from a previous video. We'll link to it up there. So the, the questions all stem from how to set up the Facebook Messenger uh, button and system for your Facebook page. Now that, there's many different ways to do this and many applications of doing this, um, but the questions all centered around one thing, people didn't have the functionality. Now, right off the bat, I'm gonna tell you, I don't really find any answers. The This is something that uh, people who've had pages for a long time, maybe they didn't get updated, or if they don't have it published, then they won't see the feature set. That's basically the answers that I could find. Um, this is it, So I'm sorry that I can't answer directly, but what I can do is walk you through the process from uh, a little different standpoint than we did in the previous video. This time we're really gonna be focusing in on a page that does not have the messenger uh, capability turned on yet. So we're gonna do that and see what changes here. Now, the first thing is, and we'll pop over to the computer, so let's get into it. Stick around to the end of the video where you're gonna get access to our three-step guide to building your Facebook page for your business. The first thing you're gonna see here is the Brilliant Infographics page. This is a client of ours, uh, and they really have not uh, had a whole lot of presence on Facebook, so that's why we're gonna be helping them out with it. Now, what we're gonna do is pop over to Settings right over here, and on the General tab, you'll see messages people cannot contact my page privately this has to be on for the for any visitor to your facebook page or follower of your page uh, to connect with you via messenger so what we need to do is click on edit we need to click this little check mark holy crap guys we just made that possible we just made it possible for people to leave a message now what does that really get us well Let's go through and see what that did. So let's pop back over to the page, and we had this video here that we could watch, or this video, we had this button here that we could watch a video of there, so we're gonna edit that button. We want people to contact us, so send a message, that'd be great. Now, next, so Messenger, you will receive messages from people in your inbox. All right, so now you can see it. We've got our send message button there. Uh, and if you actually go to the page, it's just facebook.com forward slash brilliant infographics, you can interact with this button and see what we're about to do for yourself and in the reels. So let's pop back over to settings and we're gonna go into messaging here on the left, the messaging tab. And this is gonna help walk us through how people can send messages to us what we can do to actually prompt people to send messages, and then help people start a conversation. So let's do that first. Let's give them some questions to ask. So question one, do you create the videos from templates or from scratch? Question two, How much is a video? Question three, what are your operating hours? And question four, and yeah, we won't do a question four. Cool. So we got three questions. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. This is how people can actually start some, a quick conversation with us. Now, the next thing here is our response assistant. We did go over this in that previous video. You can check the link up there, but go ahead and turn this on. We're just gonna modify the message here. So watch what goes on. So somebody says, hey, I got a question. And the auto responder, in this case, the instant reply is, hi, thanks for contacting us. We got your message and appreciate you reaching out. Well, that's not super helpful now, is it? So maybe let's say hi. Hey, there we go. So we got our little personalization effort right here, talking to the actual person who's responding. I am Matt, that's why it says, hi, Matt. And that's it, so we'll just save that. Now we will let people know we can't get to your computer 
Um, that's kind of what we just did. We don't really need to do that again. Show a messenger greeting. Yeah, we could do that. We're not gonna though. Uh, and then follow up messages automatically send customers a message after their appointment to book with you again. Now this is something that could be crucial for a service-based business um, that takes appointments or books meetings. This could be really, really great if that's you. So if that is you, then go ahead and turn this on. Yeah, send, send them a reminder, turn the follow-up message on, and then that would allow them to set another appointment via Facebook Messenger. Pretty snazzy. For us, or for Brilliant Infographics rather, we're not gonna turn that on, because why? All right, so that's basically it, guys. The new thing that they do have included here is on the Messenger platform tab. We will, I'll just give you a quick rundown. This is basically how people uh, interact with your bot uh, when you have a, a bot tied into Facebook. So bots, bot platforms are like Chatmatic, ChatFuel, um, ManyChat. You might have heard these around the internets. They can help encourage uh, engagement with your page and with your content. Uh, they can also be super annoying. So take that for what you will and enjoy what you have just set up. And hopefully you found this video valuable and helpful. If you did, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Click that little bell icon so you know when we get new video content out there. We try to post every Tuesday, but uh, sometimes the schedule just doesn't allow us to do that. So that's why we uh, turn that notification on, you get notified as soon as a new, uh, new video is live. And if you did find this valuable and you know people that this will help, please share this with them. You can hit the share button, get a direct link, or you can just copy it from your browser bar up here and, uh, and send that over in an email or text message, however. We really trying to get over uh, 5,000 subscriptions by the end of the summer, so, that's gonna be crucial for our growth. Hopefully you can, dog in the background there. Hopefully you can help make that happen and we really appreciate you turning in. If you want a step-by-step a -step guide to setting your page up on Facebook that does include this messenger run-through, please download the three-step guide to getting your business set up and going on Facebook. You can get that at getquirked.co forward slash three hyphen step hyphen guide or instead of typing that in or looking at it on the screen you can just go down in the comments click the link and you'll be good to go so download that it's absolutely free complimentary it walks you through exactly how to get things set up when you're brand new to facebook with your business and guys that's it so thank you for tuning in we'll talk at you soon